Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play Mario Sunshine. We're going to be doing one of the hardest levels that I'm sure anyone who's played this game is aware of. Mm -hmm. I look forward to it. Yeah, you look forward just to see me die a lot. <laughs> this damn so cocky all the time. Well, this level I seriously cannot let you play. <laughs> That's fine with me. I'll watch the mask. You, you would need to have been getting this far completely on your own to do this level. Oh, yeah. The sandbird is born. That sounds ominous. That's probably the way I said it. <laughs> yeah. So you actually have to fight this sandbird that you No. Okay. But it, it, I kind of wish I had to fight it because that would be a bit easier. Oh, really? Eh? It's that tough, eh? Oh, yeah. Because this requires insane platforming. Yeah. Like that. <laughs> like, and that. Every time I look over at you, I fucking hit something. I have that effect on people. Oh yeah, you just make all the girls look at your way, and then they, like, walk into a sign or something. Pretty much. Is that how you met your girlfriend? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, she walked into a white post. And you're like, oh my god, are you okay? And she's like, I love you. I am now. <laughs> I'm having your children. <laughs> This is the sand red. So, this is the eight red coins level. Oh boy. Yeah, it has wind physics too, so if you jump in place, you actually move backwards. So all you have to do is pick up the coins off this thing. And get to the top. Because not all the coins are on it. And it does this little thing that I hate very much. What's that? You'll see in a second. Okay, I, I got all... Yeah, I don't really care about that stuff, though. <laughs> He's doing it! Oh, boy. He's flapping those wings. Tail's the best part to do this. No! Oh, boy. He turned sideways. So you just needed one more coin, huh? And the one coin's at the top of the tower. Wow. But you turn sideways, and that that gets you. That gets you every time. Second time's the charm, as they say. The legendary sandbird. I thought it. I thought it was third time was the charm. Well, we're about to find out. <laughs> Is third time the charm? Like, comment, Stay and subscribe. <Yeah>. Last of life, too. Pressure's on there. There was a one up in the clouds. I used to be good enough to get everything in this level in one go. Really? Yeah, but, you know, I'm no longer a kid. <laughs> hey, you dodge it, folks. Oh, God. You have to get, like, all these red coins before he starts turning, too. Yeah, Okay, I'm gonna go on his neck this time. It's a better turn, like a dick. There we go. I think I'm safe. And he does it. At least he doesn't do a loop de loop. That would be a real dick move. <laughs> does he go back down flat eventually? Yeah, right now. Nailed it. That was actually a lot harder than it looked. My hands are sweating. Because of how intense that was. Okay, where's that last red coin? That's a blue coin. See a blue one? I think the last one's up there, actually. There it is, yeah. Oh, it's there. One time? One time? <laughs> I, I like jumped off him and dived into the red coin and it froze so the shine would come down and as soon as it came down my guy flew off the edge. Really? And you couldn't see so you couldn't get it. I couldn't. I, I died. That would irritate me. Yeah. Shine. You don't know how pissed off I was with that one. Especially if you were dying like so many times yeah. and you finally ended up getting it. It was finally one of those points where I just got like I died too many times so I got very good at the level. Yeah. 
Jesus. It's kind of like us on that Halo bridge. <laughs> we eventually knew where the rockets were going to come from, so we ended up dodging them. <laughs> yeah, I pretty much memorized that level. Okay. So, did you check what time we started this one at? Um, I think it was like 20 after. Okay. So this is the first time you see Il Pentesimo. Hold on. He's he likes to race you. He's actually mm, well, it's hard to say because no one really knows. Yeah. But people think he's known as the Running Man from the Ocarina of Time. Vaguely remember that guy. He would always run around in Ocarina of you Time. You actually think that it's him? Like some people do, especially because like you can see a little bit of him underneath. Like that, and the hairstyle is very similar. Even the outfit's kind of the same. Yeah. Could be. Eh? Are you just racing him, or you have to? Yeah. Him? Oh. I had to beat him in 35 seconds. <laughs> 2219. Oh, I still wish it was 2222. But I gotta wait for him to get up here still. Take your time there. Phew! Woo! Ah, you're pretty good. You have some speed. So I'm assuming you took a few shortcuts in that one? Nah. <laughs> Me? Shortcuts? Nah. <laughs> who, are, <laughs> who are you talking to? <laughs> That makes me laugh good, sir. <laughs> Shortcut. We now have as many shine sprites as I am old. 23. And you're 27? No, I'm 29. You didn't know that? I thought you were 27. I thought you were Sarah's age. No, Sarah the Cook. Um, yeah, the one from your work. The one you, you introduced me to that day. Oh, okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah I talk to her sometimes yeah, no, on Facebook. I'm older than her. You want to do the red coins in the coral reef? Give it a shot. See how it goes. Well, I'll get you the coral reef real quick. <laughs> <laughs> no faith, eh? None at No all. faith. I just picture you like going, is this the you coral reef? One day, I'm going to bring one of my games over here, and then we'll play it. Sure thing. And yeah, we'll see. I'm not Master, that bad at games. We'll become the teacher. <laughs> what game will confuse you the most? <laughs> there, that's the coral reef idea. I gotta do swim. Yeah, you gotta find the red coins. I can see one right now. But it will swim away from you. The, the coin will swim away from you? Yeah, it's part of the fish flock there. So if you scare them, see? Yeah. Sometimes they can go into the walls, which annoys me. You push A to go faster, by the way. Oh. You're almost out of air. Come on! There you go. Okay. Seven more. Seven Mormons go. Mormons. Mormons. Oh, I see one. Get it! That one was easy. Coin get. There's one right there, Tim. They look like piranhas. Kind of Those piranhas are going to nibble on your giblets. <laughs> it is. I like saying the word giblets. I hear it sometimes when I'm just doing my daily thing at work. Oh, yeah. Giblets. What are giblets? Like little, like... You know, like on a chicken? The... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, those. Do people actually eat those things? Sometimes. Really? I think, like, it's used in Asian cooking. Um... <laughs> I wouldn't put it past them. Yeah, I ate some pretty funky things over there. Yeah, like, I, I've heard, I'm not sure if this is true, I've only heard this, but I heard that at, um, like, some, uh, Asian bars, instead of having, like, a bowl of peanuts, they give you, like, a bowl of fried chicken cartilage. Really? Yeah. And That's chicken so feet, too. Fried chicken feet. Chicken feet? How do you think there's like, not even any meat in that? How do you do that? Well, there's no meat in cartilage, but they eat fried yeah, chicken cartilage. So are all the coins in this area? Yes. You're just missing them completely. I see that. 
No, you don't, oh, because otherwise you wouldn't be messing them completely. Oh, mind blown. Two more. <laughs> mind freak. <laughs> Remember that beach bag. <laughs> wow, that's that's a new word for our show. Oh, we've said like <laughs> we've said many swears before, but not that one. That one's not that bad. You can't say that all the time. What a douche nozzle. <laughs> that's a new one. I haven't heard that one before. You've never heard someone call someone a douche nozzle? Is that a coin over there? No, that's a fish. Um, maybe you should try looking in the crevice. This crevice right here. I don't know, I don't I wasn't paying attention to which ones you got to now. Probably is down here. I, I paid attention to the first like five you got, but not anymore. Probably down here somewhere. Wouldn't it be cool to actually swim through something like this? That would be really cool. I just think it would feel weird if it ever made contact with you. Like if your arm rubbed against it or something, you'd be like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it would feel kinda creepy. Is it down there? Uh I think I got this one already. I guess you did. Where did you go? Maybe be on like the side of it. I don't know. Where are you, Mr. Coin? I like the flood though that's on your back. It's gonna turn you into a monster. Is it? You're gonna become a flood. Hmm. I think they all are in the coral reef though, because it did say red coins in the coral reef. Can't go through there. One of my biggest fears is getting like my legs stuck underwater. Drowning. Yeah. Or like that's that just that panic struggle you're having trying to get your leg undone. Yeah. That would suck. Have you ever been like in the ocean or anything like that? Before? Not the ocean. No. It's lakes. Lakes and rivers and all that stuff. Yeah. One thing I honestly have to say I hate though is the feeling of sand between my toes. Really? I hate that feeling. Even like on the beach, like if you're yeah, like, outside. Yeah. Dry of the sand. Really, wet yeah. sand. I hate that feeling. It's not only is it like so grainy, but then like it gets under your nails and it's just like, eh, yeah, yeah, I hate that feeling. And yeah, you wouldn't, you wouldn't like the ocean then, because when you get out of the ocean, uh, it's all the salt sticks yeah. to your skin. Yeah. I heard that stuff yeah. that before. Okay. And it really like just disturbs me to think about that kind of thing. <laughs> I mean, they have like showers and stuff on the beach. Well, all most things. resorts have showers and stuff on the beach. Well, I hope the resort has a shower at least. Yeah. Oh. Is that it? Oh, no. Oh, SOB. Wait, wait, go do it though. Dive down. Nope. Hmm. Where can this red coin be? It's really making our show seem boring. Yeah. The people watching it are probably like, oh my god, you're so stupid, you just swam by it. Watching it, I thought they all turned it off by now. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> Pretty much as you and I know. Yeah, just us. Talking to each other. Oh, let's Actually, check probably, this side. Probably more like talking to ourselves at this point. Pretty sure I got the one over here. But. Let's check over here. Oh, oh, dive down. Oh. It's right behind you. What are you? I was stuck on the stupid thing. On the stupid coral. The stupid coral. <laughs> have you have you stupid seen coral. those things of The Walking Dead? Coral! I said stay back. Oh, Carl. <laughs> yeah, but it's just he sang that, and there's like a piece of coral behind him. Oh yeah. Coral. <laughs> He's actually British in real life. They didn't I know. Him. That's crazy. So many freaking actors on TV these days are British. So many actors you can't tell what nationality they are. They hide their accents so well. Oh. They're just natural born liars. Yeah, that's freaking jerks. I think all actors should be lawyers. <laughs> and then like, depending on who you hire, like their rates depend on how good their films are. <laughs> because that would pretty much dictate how good of a liar they are, right? Depends on what accent they use. How good of an actor they are, because <laughs> yeah. all a lawyer does is act and lie his way through court. Pretty much, you have to be good at talking. Though. Except for Phoenix Wright. Exactly. Objection! That's the game. Oh. <laughs> okay, so we're chasing him again, and then this level will be done. Really? Well, we still got that one level afterwards, but we only need to capture Shadow Mario in each level. Yeah. That was like a bunch of fat or something. I think it might actually be like. 
No, and it, I think it's actually fat because acidic fruit gets rid of it. Really? C acidic fruit juice. <laughs> lard. Yeah, it might just be lard. Or shortening. <laughs> this guy. I don't like how he runs away in such odd patterns. I'm like an alligator, I can't chase things that are in zigzags. <laughs> Remember, if you ever want to get away from Ren, just run in zigzags. <laughs> yeah. He won't be able to keep up with you. Chase your remote in five seconds last time. What? What? I said you, you chase them for about five seconds and then you ask. I said back, back flip. Okay, we probably just lost like three subscribers because of that backflipping thing. <laughs> I lost him. I lost him. Where'd he go? How did that mess? There we go. So this level's done. So they said we were gonna find out his identity. No, that's in the amusement park level. Oh. Are we going to that one next? Yeah. And you'll find out in this next actual stage. Oh, yeah? On the next episode of... <laughs> Super Mario Sunshine. Uh, on the next episode of Who Gives a Rat's Ass. Because <laughs> I'm just dying to know. Oh, I'm sure you are. I'm sure you can't even guess who he is yet. I have no freaking idea. You can't even tell by that boat. Secret. Secret? Secret shortcut. Yeah, it's not that much of a secret. I bet. Cutscene. Mario! So, any idea who he might be now? I'm gonna go out on a limb and say Bowser. Close! Oompa Troompa? Ah, uh, you're getting a bit further. <laughs> Wario? <laughs> That'd be a little bit of a dark spin to it. If it's not Bowser, I have no idea. You'll see soon. The I villain secret hideout. <laughs> I forgot the water gun on my back talk. Yeah, kind of just there. And this is our main form of transport. Cannon. Pretty good shot. <laughs> Way off, actually. In the park. Mecha Bowser appears. Mecha Bowser. Mega Mecha Bowser. What other game is Mecha Bowser in? None. This is the first one. So now what I know who it was. Yes, it's not Mecha Bowser. Actually, before I go in, there was this one thing I read on the computer that I thought was funny, yeah. and I wanted to tell you about it. It was um, it was a picture of Legolas. Yeah. And it goes Lego Legolas, and it shows a picture of Lego Legolas. And then they took away his legs, and it says Legless Lego Legolas. And then they put a picture of a Legless Lego Legolas with a girl, and it goes Lego Legolas's Lego, Legless Lego Legolas's lass. <laughs> and then it said. Leg Lego legless Lego lasses like legless lass. <laughs> and it was just like it was so hard to say. Tongue twister, right? Okay. Anyways, back to back to Mario. You can't kill him here, by the way. Holy crap! You know how you kill those guys? How? Shoot water on the ground and they go over No, shoot water on them, and then when it comes back, it shocks them. So, anyways. Well, you can always just do this. <laughs> Much quicker? Yeah. Okay, so now you're gonna find out who Shadow Mario really is. Alright. Waiting for this moment my whole life. Finally! The time has come to reveal myself. <laughs> really? You're 29, though? Yeah. <laughs> you know that? I could have sworn you were 27. You look younger than me. <laughs> Look at my baby face. <laughs> That's Mecha Bowser. This guy right. Um, what he's on. He can't see anything. He's behind <laughs> us. Turn around. I want to see. 
This is like my favorite boss fight in this game. Yeah. We're about to find out. After we beat him. Of course we have to beat him. I'm trying to think of what other villains there are in Mario. I'm sure once I see who it is, I'm probably going to know. I will say this, he's not a part of the Koopa Kids. No. But he's related to Bowser heavily. He is in Super Nintendo games. Yeah. Okay, so the thing is, you ride this roller coaster around, and you pick up these rockets as you go around. Yeah. And you have to shoot them at him. That doesn't seem to go well. Wow. That one hit him, I think. Yeah. So he shoots the rockets at you, and you. Have See? Direct hit. Oh, that one missed. Slightly to the back. Oh, yeah. No, he shoots bullet bills at us. We oh. shoot these rockets at him. Oh, that hit the wall. One more hit, one more hit. Oh, baby. Oh, that was way <laughs> off. <laughs> I, hey, I said way off, you don't have to. You got a little dude. It doesn't matter. I, I, it's not like it's time. That one was way off. Want me to finish them off for you? It's okay. It's okay. Don't drink from my mind. Come on. I don't care. <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> it's like as his head moved forward. The thing it like just bobbed just forward. Just grazed his little... There we go. I think he's dead now. Yeah. Oh, one more hit, eh? One. Like six times. One, uh, one more hit. No, that was five. One more. Hey, it's a lot harder than it looks to aim. Next one. Try your heart. Boom! <laughs> <laughs> he got lucky. Oh, for sure. He got lucky. Trick shot at him. <laughs> There's Peach. I gotta find out who he is. I can't wait. Next time! <laughs> <laughs> Slaps her nose. Yeah. Well, you're right about her. Clearly her and Bowser had a... His name is Baby Bowser. Okay, so yeah, I have her. I was thinking about saying that, but... So is Peach actually here? Oh. It's never fully, truly answered. Yeah. Like, he, Bowser, Bowser could have raped her at one point. I mean, they've certainly spent enough time with one another. You never know. Yeah, like seven castles worth. Yeah. Like, that's kind of messed up. So, if you think, it, like, and also, what girl is Bowser getting it on with to make all these kids? Like, if you think about it, in Super Mario 3, there is the Koopa kids, and there's like seven of them. Yeah. 
there's never any female Bowser that you've ever seen. At least that I know of. Yeah, the only the only other real female in this game, other than like the humanoid ones, such as like Daisy, Peach, and um, you know the chick from uh, Galaxy. Yeah. Yeah. Rosalina. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Other than them, the only other real female female is uh, Birdo. I don't know who that is. She's from uh, Mario too. Oh. She's the one that shoots eggs out of her mouth. Oh, okay. And actually, some say even though she has a bow on her head, she's a guy. Really? Yeah. Well, there's that female in the third Super Mario for Nintendo, the boss. It's like a pink one. Yeah, but that's she one of his daughters. Shoots. Okay, then, yeah, I guess that would be who he would be copulating. Like, even if he did do it with her to make the other kids, how did he make her? Exactly. It's yeah. a good question. So yeah, that's the next stage over there, but this one here is still for completing. Okay, I'll switch it over to you again. All right. What are you doing now? Whatever it says. Find out. It's a secret level, I think. Yep. Cannons. Okay. But um, the only way that you can actually link that Peach ends up with Luigi yeah. is from Super Mario Galaxy. Oh yeah. Rosalina lets on many tips that she is Princess Peach's daughter. Yeah. From another timeline. Really? And um, she gives out hints like she remembers how tall her father was, and Mario's short. Yeah. And how like green and something else he was, and it's just like that's Lu that's Luigi. She's talking about Luigi. <laughs> and you just link it all together, and it's like, oh, Peach banged Luigi and made Rosalina. Oh, green slut, eh? Okay, in order to beat him, shoot those things he's throwing out, the little bombs, with water, and then throw them back at him. I said throw them, not detonate them. Oh, to throw. B? Yes. Yeah, just press B to pick one up. And then press B again. You have to hit him three times, I think. That way we're just not here for two hours while you figure it out. Yeah. Oh, you got hurt. You got hurt by the explosion. There you go. One more. We're almost there, man. That didn't count. I don't think you hit him. Come on. One more. Oh, come on. Okay, seriously, Mario, you don't. I don't think that's gonna count. Oh, it did. I guess you just barely nicked him. Yeah. That one looked farther than the other one that I threw. Grazed him. Sure. Now you have to... Well, that was just to get into the level. Yeah! Oh my god. You really thought that was it? I thought that was We're it. We're halfway through the game, bro. <laughs> okay, yeah. I'm in the thing. No, you're not. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's another one of these. Uh, I saw it as a secret there. level. All secret levels are like that. I hope it's a slide one. Nope. It's the disappearing floor one. Oh, that's good. I know, it's your favorite. So when do we see Yoshi? Um, after you get a certain amount of shine sprites. At least they give you good warning that they're about to disappear. Yeah. Now just imagine trying to get the nine red coins in this level. Yeah, that would <laughs> Alright, I'm No, you have to jump on those. You have to jump on those, yeah. I thought that sign was like, um, you know that famous picture, the Screamer? Yeah. It looked like that from, like, when you're bouncing up that view. Yeah, it does kind of. Just dive it? across because this is gonna be hard. Nope, 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 nope. I keep doing that. Wait, can I just run across here? Nope. That, that's what that's what you fall onto. To well, every time I go to press B for some reason, I always go to, I press Y instead. I don't know why. I'm just not used to it. That's not like any other controllers has a B button. Not shaped like this. What other controller actually has a legit B button? B button. Um, Super Nintendo one does. I meant like. Company wise, I thought you were talking about like you're used to a PS3 controller, like that has no B button. Oh, no, I just mean the layout. I'm not used to it. Please, I'm not 
I like how the background's kind of like uh, Yoshi's Island. Yeah. For the Super Nintendo. Have you played that? Yep. That's the one where you f meet Baby Bowser for the first time. He becomes gigantic at the end. He's the final boss. I don't. I never actually. Knew. What? Yeah. <laughs> no, you're gonna die. You're dead. Well, it was worth it. No, it wasn't. <laughs> Do it all over again. Yeah. Oh god, we're just gonna be here for an endless loop as you pick up the extra life and die. <laughs> How the hell are you even supposed to get that free man without dying? It's a trap! <laughs> Clearly. No, I, I can probably get it. Yeah, you're just so good. I know! I keep telling you that. <laughs> you just don't listen. Oh boy. You just don't listen to me. I'm, I'm, I'm amazing, okay? <laughs> Yeah, like, how many games have we played together now? <laughs> you know my cheat methods always work, such as, like, run through the mobs of enemies. <laughs> I'm good at running. Cheating. Yeah, fuck okay. that shit. I wouldn't say I'm good at cheating. Good at improvising, though. Mario, why'd you stop? Okay. This is hard to watch. Yeah, well, I'm sure you died a few times when you played it first. Sure. Because <laughs> yeah. you can't die. You can't turn while you're dive jumping. But I'm not 29 years old. Yeah, but I've never played this game once in my life. Oh Before yeah, sure. Today. You played Galaxy. Galaxy, nothing like this. Same mechanics. Different controller. Right? Different controller. Oh, boy. <laughs> All right. This music is getting irritating though. Mario sucks. He really does not jump very well. Kinda wish like Link would just land him that hook shot or something. <laughs> now I gotta wait for this stupid thing. It looks like giant erasers from grade like three. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I wonder how many people are gonna get that reference. <laughs> I'm surprised you get that for you. You're only 20 years old. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> okay, this time. I'm just gonna run normally. No, you'll die. To the to the edge. No, you'll die. Oh, uh, uh. Told you. Are you freaking like? How the hell would I know that that was coming up? <laughs> because your camera. Oh, game oh, over. Okay, here you do it. Oh, come on, man. You do it. Some of these games, you, I have to like just lend you and let you <laughs> yeah, brush up on my skills a little bit before we play them. Yeah, so it's not quite. But then again, it's more fun to like have you have your first experience blind. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. No, I'm, I'm enjoying this game actually. Even though you've been watching most of it. Yeah. <laughs> Sometimes it is just fun to watch games. I like doing that. Anyway, my girlfriend's not a big gamer, but uh, she watches you play. Yeah, sometimes. Resident Evil and stuff like that, she's into. Like PT. PT, she thought was kind of boring. She's like, well, you just what about the, the same room over what about the game. full version? Oh, like the Silent Hills. No, the full version of PT. That was just a demo you played. I know, but it it was a demo of it was a playable teaser of a game that hasn't been released yet. Yeah. Well, actually, I think it's out now. No, it's Silent Hills. It's a teaser for a Silent Hills game. Yeah, for the PT Silent Hills, which is going to be related to that game. Yeah, but the Silent Hills game isn't going to be out. I believe it is. Okay. And I play these games. I, I like these types of games. Yeah, I'm not very good with horror. Have you played Outlast yet? Yeah, I beat it. Oh, have you? Yeah. Did both of them? No, not the whistleblower one. I got Outlast free because I'm a PS Plus subscriber ah. for the PS4. So did you enjoy the ending where um, you became... Yeah, that was kind of neat. Spoiler alert. Yeah. <laughs> I thought it was pretty cool, but yeah, that was a freaky game. Well, at, at least it's not really spoiler alert because all I said was you became... Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought one was going to appear there. Sure you did. I did. <coughs> Why is there a problem with that? 
Did you play PT though? No. No, your cup of tea, eh? What? No, your cup of tea. No. I, I thought you said n not because I thought you said something like because you're a coward, eh? Oh. I was like, fuck you too, man. <laughs> <laughs> that was uncalled for. Okay, stop talking about horror games. <laughs> it's riling you up a little bit. <laughs> I'm just imagining them in my head, and I'm like, no! Let's never play those on this channel. <laughs> I gotta get him off the topic before he gets something bad in his head about it. <laughs> well, I'm actually surprised that you're... Uh, have you started Dead Space, right? No, not yet. Not yet? Okay. I, I want to, though. It's just one of those things that's like... I'm not sure how good I'll do it on my own because I'll be terrified of the yeah. game and talking while terrified is kind of... <laughs> it's, uh, yeah, it's, I mean, it's scary, but it's more, a little more action-oriented than... Yeah, because I have never survival. played Dead Space. Yeah. I know, I, I'm not sure how. The first one is definitely the scariest one of them. That's how it's done, ladies and gents. And on top of the little magical small pyramid where he floats <laughs> is the shine. The shine. 27. We got 19 minutes, I think. 19? Oh, my girlfriend does Did she get off really? No. I just told her that we found the cat. She's like, oh, good. <laughs> <laughs> well, she said more than that. Oh, good. Shifty eyes. I have to leave the door open wider next time. I mean... I mean, uh... I didn't leave the door open wide this time. Red coins on the pirate ship. Oh, I hate this level, actually. Red coins? On the pirate ship. I'm actually not a big fan of this part. No? Just because, um... You know the pirate ship rides at most amusement parks? Yeah. Where it goes upside down and everything? Yeah. Yeah, try getting them on a pirate ship like that when they're outside of it. What the fuck that? Luckily, <laughs> I know a cheat. <laughs> they're not cheats, they're shortcuts. <laughs> oh, wait. Hello. I know it's in the green ones. Blue's in the green. First one. He's definitely like that pirate ship right at uh, Canada's one. Don't like that shit. Oh, I meant to do a backflip. When is the last time you played this game? Long time ago, probably like a year. At, at least a year, if not two. As you remember the location you Fuck. Stuff. Oh, it's I used to be able to do this on my first try. Yeah, you try back flipping onto a twig. <laughs> Not as easy as I make it look. Okay. There should be a red coin, right? There. Oh, it's up there. On the other side. It's up on this one. It's blue. So where's the? There's a red one right there. It's right where? Ahead of you. Oh, there it is. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Fuck you. <laughs> You did that on purpose. <laughs> you did this to me. <laughs> You're dead to me. <laughs> so close, but yet so. Old. <laughs> I I I jumped for it, hit the mast, bounced off the mast, and missed it by like. I thought you were gonna get it there for a second. So did I. <laughs> the game was like, nope, I don't like you. Right over the boat. But you know what? I'm gonna cheat. Oh no, sorry. I'm gonna shortcut. I'm gonna shortcut. <laughs> wall, move. Yeah, I don't like walls. Walls annoy me. 
Oh crap. Press the wrong button. Yeah, I did. I meant to push A. But I haven't done any of the cage levels like you did. Oh, so you're not you're a little rusty on the cages, eh? Yeah, that's the button. <laughs> what was <laughs> You're just like <laughs> they made silly sounds. <laughs> Is that another red coin I saw at the top of there? Yeah. Oh, okay. But, unfortunately for me, it's on this side. Oh, it's, on. <laughs> it's not that west side or the east side. No, it's not. It's the dark side. Yes, it is. There's <laughs> <laughs> another red coin on that green thing. Have you ever heard that song before? Yeah. You haven't heard the rap, um, not rap battle, um, the Star Wars rap? Uh, I don't think so. Oh, Is it yeah, one of those epic rap battle ones? No, no, no. Okay, on what green thing? Uh, it was uh, like one of the, like, the top like pipes or whatever. Okay, I'm gonna go look for that now. Because I, I'm not seeing much right now. I got five out of eight and I'm actually kind of confused as to where the rest okay. of them are. Where? On that. See it right there? Oh, wait. Oh, wait. See it right underneath it? Oh, that thing over there? Yeah, sorry. It looked like it was on the green. I guess you have to jump on the uh, Oh, there's one right there, that. too. Okay, so that means there's one more. Oh! I found them all. Is that a red one? Six, found them all. Seven's up top. Is that a red one right there? Yeah, right across from here. But I fell off. Nine Mario's jumping on a bed. One fell off and whacked his head. Nailed it. Okay, so that's the last one right there. Mr. Boom Coin. Think I care? <laughs> you were like literally standing beside it. You could have just pressed left on the analog stick. You would have got it. Oh, it's too late now. How's it too late? Too late. <laughs> Don't even care. <laughs> Am I just you're just teasing me? Yeah. <laughs> Am I just you know? Is, is it is it bothering? You? Maybe 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 if I do this. Maybe, maybe if I maybe if I whoops. <laughs> just they're so tantalizingly close. <laughs> I don't like how he throws his shell like a boomerang. I don't know how that works. It seems like they uh, change up a few mechanics in this one. Uh, do your turtles ever throw their shells at you? My turtle bit me in the back. Oh, that bastard. Yeah. They were fighting each other, and I tried to separate them. One of them bit my pinky. They, they, were, they were fighting each other. Yeah. Turtle battles, eh? Turtle battles. Were, they, were they mutant ninja turtles? <laughs> I, I hope your I hope your your turtles are Einstein and Shell no Rocky. Einstein and Rocky. Rocky. Rocky's the mean one. He likes to pick on Einstein. Even though Einstein's bigger, he runs away like a little bitch. It would have been better if you just named um if you got a third one and named him Balboa. <laughs> Einstein and Rocky Balboa. That would be pretty sweet. That would be pretty sweet actually. Okay, well, so my girlfriend just texted me and said you better be on your way home. Oh no. <laughs> Tell her I'm gonna be a little bit late. Just tell her you'll be late by you'll be going in five minutes. The wilted sunflower. Yeah, just say you'll be leaving in five minutes. She'll get over it. She'll be over it. <laughs> like, come on, come on, boy. Oh boy. Boss. Who's the boss? Like a boss. <laughs> Have you seen that video? Which one? Like a boss. Like an actual music video? Yeah. Who sings it? What? Who sings it? I don't know who sings it. Is it a rap song? Um, yeah. It's like... So take us through a day of the life in the boss. The only one I can think of is a song like Slim Thug, but it's... 
I can't remember. I know he says boss in it a hundred like a hundred times, but I can't remember what it's called. Well the guy goes like um Chop my balls off like a boss. Okay, then yeah, that's not what I'm thinking of. I turn into a plane, crashing to the sun. Now I'm dead, like a boss. Oh, so it's a joke video. Yeah. Oh, okay. I thought you were talking like a real, like music video. Like... Suck a dude's dick, like a boss. <laughs> Ask Deborah out. Get rejected. Vom on Deborah's desk. Shit on Deborah's desk, like a boss. <laughs> So are you, are you supposed to be doing this right now? Yeah. All these stupid turtles. All, all these stupid turtles. I don't know about you, but they're kind of smart. They're kind of stupid to me. Really? Can turtles home in on you? I think that's the last of them. You're a bunch of sunflowers? Yeah. Well, they're wilting because those turtles are eating their roots. Uh, poor sunflowers. Yeah, I know. You know sunflowers are actually, like, you know what they do, right? I don't know, I thought it was going to be some like hardcore answer. I don't know, they grow, they make sunflower seeds. What, what, what else <laughs> they do, do those. <laughs> they do do those, I'm not going to lie. <laughs> oh, there's Yoshi. But what they... um, In any like kind of nuclear fallout game, if you see sunflowers, it means something good. Because sunflowers absorb radiation from the ground and neutralize it. Really? Yeah. That's kind of hard, So if there's ever a nuclear war, and sunflowers are growing from the site, you know that it's safe to enter there because they're absorbing the uh, so they radiation. Just to, they should just go to Chernobyl, plant like a million sunflowers. Yeah. And be good. But then again, I'm not sure about like the full me mechanic behind it. Like they might not grow in radiated soil. They might uh, only only things that existed there before. Okay. I'm not okay. sure. Oh, that makes sense, you just went around in a big circle, you stupid idiot. <laughs> okay, he wants bananas. Banana. Which are right here. Save and continue. Befriended Yoshi. So yeah, this is Yoshi. He shoots juice. Watch. Eh, zoom in. So Yoshi. Hey Toad <laughs> And then he and then he just eats he eats fruit. No, if you eat enough stuff, does he start pooping out stuff in like the other games? No no, no. But he changes color and shoots different colored oh. juices. It's like this one makes him pink and he shoots now, different colored juices do different things? No. This one shoots. So these chilies make him grape. Yeah. Papaya oh, make yeah, this color change. Right? Yeah. Like Papaya make itself. him an orange flavored. Pineapple keep him that color. Um, melons make him pink and bubblegum flavored. And those make him do that again. Interesting. Now, if I recall, there's a glitch. I don't know if I can pull it off because I've only done it once. But you kind of have to like jump. It makes you fall through the floor. And falling through the floor lets you get Yoshi over to that island. Oh yeah. Which otherwise you have to do this long complicated stretch. Yeah, I go for the bridge. And, uh, like, literally, it could take you a full hour to do that. Seriously? Yeah, that's how bad it is. Because Yoshi dies in the water. Oh, really? Watch. You can't swim at all? Yeah, watch. <laughs> no. Okay. Well, he's like, he's like, uh, um, uh, what? Like, paint? Yes, he's just like, uh, Baby Bowser in, uh, Shadow Mario form. Oh, okay. He's made out of paint. So you have to go through like this long trial of hopping onto boats and getting all your timings correctly. Or you can go through that thing, fall below, go over to the island, jump up, and then you're on the island. <laughs> Seems a little uh, easier to me. Than That's like the only actual cheat I know in this game. Everything else is just shortcuts or skill jumps. Believe what you want. 
Or what's the point of getting to that island? Is it just like a secret level? Yeah, there's a secret level on there. It's the second hardest secret level in the game. The first hardest is the one I made you do in between episodes. Oh, okay. With the pachinko machine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I didn't even come close to doing that. Yeah, that, that one we'll probably do as a joke thing after we beat Bowser. But... <laughs> we'll devote like a whole level. Yeah, a whole, a whole hour to that. that. Yeah. We'll have like a special final part. Bonus. So again, I'm I'm gonna cheat. <laughs> because you see, you have to climb up the back of this thing. Yeah. Or Or you can say, fuck the police. Blue point. And go up this way. Because you have to get to the top of the Ferris wheel and you have to go through the entire back of it. Oh, I missed. <laughs> Barely. I'll make it. I'll make it, don't you worry. I don't know. I trust you. <laughs> I trust your cheating skills. <laughs> yeah, pretty good. It's, uh... I know you have it in you. I know you have the cheats within you. <laughs> you have to believe in yourself, young one. <laughs> young Padawan. <laughs> Whoa. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna right. I'm gonna be serious from like a manager's perspective. Whoever puts this like maintenance shell shaft here, where the fucking roller coaster comes and touches, <laughs> wasn't a good idea. was not the best idea. There it is. Yeah, and then I just gotta. Powering the fairs with? Yeah, he was making it go crazy. Uh, but you see, like, there's this entire back thing there with, like, several thousands of obstacles all the way up. Yeah. This just saved us five minutes. I like it. <laughs> I like it. That is it. a cheat I approve of. And now the Ferris wheel goes back to normal. Now my girlfriend's pregnant. Now your girlfriend's what? Oh. oh. I thought you said now she's gone. I was like, what? <laughs> Hello? Oh, you're answering it on there. Can I call you back in like five minutes? Alright, I'll talk to you in a minute. Okay. Whoa! That was not cool. I just like glitched off. I have to get all the way back up there now. So what are we what are we supposed to be doing now? Getting the shine. You missed it? I didn't miss it. I glitched off. Oh. I was trying to get down so I can jump onto the ferris wheel to get me up there, Yeah. and um, my character decided to slide down the side of it, and it just flung him halfway across the map. Way back. It's okay, I already took the shortcut once. Where's the uh, shine thing? Is it at the top? It's, at the, it it's even higher up than that. Yeah. That's why you have to get on the actual ferris wheel now. Because you see right, right about, he was right there. Shines all the way up there. Oh. No. So we have to go on one of those little, uh, Yeah, on the top of one of them. Nailed it. Nailed it. You just see the person inside. <laughs> Imagine if someone was in that when it was spinning really fast. <laughs> they just get off and they're like, <laughs> they're like Yoshi all over the place. <laughs> there we go. Awesome. Save it. I'm gonna... Okay. Save and continue. So we're at 30 now. We just passed your age. Yeah, we did. I didn't even think of that. <laughs> it's always got the turbo nozzle. Oh boy. You wanna get that before we end the episode? Well, I'll give it a shot. Yeah, well, whatever. Anyways, thank you all for watching. <laughs> we'll do it next time. Yeah. You, ha you have to go. Yeah. Your girlfriend's waiting. You don't want to keep a girl waiting. Well, thanks for keeping us company. Yeah, and uh, thank you all for watching. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Super Mario Sunshine. And we'll see you all in the next one. See you later. Toodles! <laughs> That's my word. Toodles? Yeah.